Hi friends, Wesley with Expand the Craft here, testing out my selfie stick uh, skills. This video is about propellers and motors, which I don't sell, but I want to tell you about them. Uh, this is the 16 foot Expand the Craft, um, which there's plenty of videos showing this going through the water. Uh, it, it shows it with a larger motor, but this one is a 18 pound thrust electric motor. Now I use this, I did a test with this battery. It's a uh, lithium iron phosphate uh, battery, very lightweight, doesn't weigh hardly anything. Uh, and this is another, it's like eight pounds, 10, uh, not even 10 pounds, something like that. It's ridiculously lightweight, but it pushes this boat almost as fast actually as the big 65 pound thrust motor that I put on it. And I'm gonna show you why if you stick with me on this video about propeller shape. This is a two bladed cupped prop. This is what you want if you're looking to go fairly quickly and super efficiently with a boat like this expand the craft or even a kayak. Now. Given the same amount of power, this Expander Craft catamaran is far more efficient and faster than a standard fishing kayak. Uh, it's because of, um, well, two long skinny hulls of a catamaran is just more efficient through the water than a big fat Hobie um, fishing kayak. Just is what it is. Um, anyway, this cupped propeller is far more efficient. And so when I did a test with this 18 pound thrust, which I, it's got two settings. I never need setting number two. As a matter of fact, it gets so fast that the water tends to cavitate behind the, um, the shaft. So the shaft either needs to have a foil shape made to it, which I could easily do, uh, or I just set it on setting number one. You can also paddle this boat while uh, well, you can just straight up paddle, but you can paddle and motor and just go for days. I, I, put, I spent four hours on the thing and it barely registered any um, uh, level drop on the uh, electric, uh, uh, on, the, on the battery. Can't speak. Okay, now here we have a 65 pound thrust. Now this is the, the, the 16 footer is sitting on the triple 21. And this on this triple 21, uh, it goes just fine with, with this 65 pounder. Um, and I'll show you something about this propeller. Now this propeller, let me get down there. Okay. This is a three bladed prop and it has this curvature to it. That is a de-weeding kind of thing. Three blades. Now it will push your boat very nicely and it's a de-weeding kind of thing. However, it's not as efficient as the other blade. So on the same battery with the same boat, you may get the same speed with the larger motor with this triple bladed prop, but you'll go less distance. That's efficiency. Um, what makes a electric motor good or not so good for a kayak, a canoe, or in this case, expand the craft modular boat is the pitch of the prop and the shape of the prop, not how much power the motor generates or takes up. It's about, well, these, 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 uh, these props were made to push a heavy boat slowly, not a lightweight boat quickly. The first one that I showed you with the cupped two blade, that is made to push a lightweight boat quickly. It is not made for a heavy boat. So it may look undersized. And I know a lot of you guys are like, why don't you put a 14 horsepower in it? Uh, something crazy, ridiculous. You don't need that much power. You just don't need it. This is overkill at a six horsepower gas motor for the triple 21. It does about 15 miles an hour. Uh, okay, so uh, back to this is, this is an option for you. Is that if you can go nearly as fast or as fast with an 18 pound thrust motor, which is like a hundred bucks, and go so, for hours and hours and hours with it, 
Why do you need an expensive three, five, seven, eight hundred dollar electric motor on a kayak or a catamaran like this? The fact is, you don't need it. Okay, now I just said a whole lot of words about motors and propellers when I don't sell motors and propellers. I sell the boats that they go on. Expand the craft is my um, product. If you haven't already seen, we have these boats going through the water with those motors on it. So that's a different video. If you go to uh, expandthecraft.com, you can check out uh, pricing on those uh, boats. And um, you can see some of the other boats that we have, uh, outriggers on canoes and other outriggers on kayaks. Don't forget to subscribe. You get to see these boats in action.